Hey guys, I do government to retrieve Toyota armed Jeep, 21 other vehicles from ex deputy governor Philip Shaibu. Hey, interesting. Nigerians, bass goes everywhere who, as he did for River States. Now, 60 days for Bini Sanha Sanha. But at least, na na River State oh, na he could pass waiting with the state experience for Bini, uh, uh, for Edo State. Naira News reports that this was made known in a public notice signed by the State Commission of Information and Orientation, Chris Osa, on Tuesday. In the notice titled, Publish Notice, on retrieval of 22 official government vehicles, the commissioner disclosed that Shaibo, Philip Shaibo, has been given seven days to return the vehicles. He stated that should the former deputy governor fail to obey the directive, security agencies have been put on alert to retrieve the vehicles. The notice read, the Edo state government hereby issues this notice directing the retrieval of official government vehicles allocated to the office of the deputy governor, Edo State, which are currently in the custody of the former deputy governor, Philip Shaibo. The former deputy governor is by this notice given a seven days ultimatum from the date of this publication to return the vehicles as Relevant security agencies have been put on an alert to retrieve the vehicles after the expiration of the notice. Niger News also recorded that Shaibu was impeached by the Edo State House of Assembly after the fallout with Governor Basaki allegedly over his gubernatorial ambition. Shaibu also later replaced by marvelous Omobayo Omo Godwin a former chieftain of the Labour Party. So guys, as you can see, uh, this is what is happening in Edo State. Though Nigerians have this to say, why on earth did you assign as much as 22 vehicles to one person? This is my, my, my point too. Even if it's yourself, it means you have up to 40 to 50 to yourself. This is irrespons irresponsibility. Or oh, you believe this? Office of deputy is different to Shaibu himself. There is nothing bad for deputy office to have 20 cars because the governor office used up to 30 plus cars. Uh, I don't know. Nigerians, some people, eh? I don't, I don't know. Nigerians are so gullible. What kind of democracy are we practicing? That is why the like of Mwike is dancing in the midst of hardship and uh, hunger, yet we applaud them. How can someone have 21 vehicles? This is just the one they announced. What is it doing with 21 vehicles? For goodness sake, you are going to drive one at a time. So what is the need? Those things are waste. Our politicians are big problem we are facing. I'm not even talking about retrieving the vehicle. I am imagining how someone can have up to 21 vehicles waiting if they do it. Huh? Is this not madness? So you go just park vehicles, they keep, you go, call, you go wake up in the morning, you start watching them. When they say they, those money, those money that was used to purchase those vehicles will be enough to do tangible things for, you know, for the people in your state. If they use and they parade yourself. You see, in Western world, these things do not happen. You can even see their portable house, where they are living, like bungalow, you get. But here, yeah, they will build a castle for themselves. When they don't reach how many years, they don't even climb up again. There are some rooms they will have in their compound. They have, not, they have never been there for like 10 years. What is the meaning? Is it not stupidity? These people, they will steal money they cannot even spend. They will die live up. Does it make sense? So Nigerians are gargolable. Look at what somebody is saying. What is drunk if you have 21 vehicles? Hello? 
Everything is wrong about it. Everything is wrong about it. The people that gave out and the one that received, all of them are wrong. I go reject. What will I do with two ve- uh, 21 vehicles? If you're talking about two vehicles, it's okay. Maybe if I come out, they, the, the people go contact now and say you have poverty mentality. Who told you? Who told you? Life is vanity upon vanity. All those things is, is needless. You don't need them. There are people that need that, that, that need these things as well. And you are keeping it without using them. Sometimes, after some years, you go go put key like this. Engine don't knock. Oh yeah, not the day inside. You know the starter. You just drop a car for so, so many years. You are not driving them. How can someone drive 21 vehicles? How are you going to be driving 21 vehicles? Does it make sense? These are the ones government say they gave to him. What of his personal ones? So these people should be counting about 30 something vehicles. Because Nigerian politicians, they cannot have only four cars. They must have up to their, their personal eight cars or ten cars. Plus the one they steal from the government dump. This is not funny. This is not funny, Nigerians. This is not funny. Anyway, let him re- let them retrieve it. Now the question is, if they retrieve it, what are they going to do with it? Hand it over to another <laughs> another deputy governor. What a shame. So guys, let's hear from you. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you and bye for now.